every day we brush our teeth, we flush the toilet, we do the dishes. All of these things are done without a second thought because it's almost second nature. However, with more and more emphasis placed on recognizing our impact on the environment, Officials at Sanford Sewage District's Pollution Control Facility decided it was important for locals to see just what happens with the water that they use every day. So, on Saturday, May 17th, the treatment plant hosted an open house with guided tours of the facility from 9 until 2 p.m. The facility processes around 2 million gallons of water every 30 hours, said Andre Brusso, chief operator of the mill. The water first comes from a plant on Jagger Mill Road where all of the large debris, anything more than half an inch in diameter, is filtered out. It then comes to the Pollution Control Center where it goes through four steps, all of which can be monitored by a master computer in the facility. Step one, the remaining grit, anything that wasn't filtered out on Jagger Mill Road, is removed from the water. Grit settles down, in fact it's just kicking on now, and the grit is removed by a classifier that has a vortex uh, action in it. This is the grit that comes out? That's the grit. Step two, oxygen is added to the water, which helps filter out bacteria. This process is called denitrification. It's important that we want to denitrify here because if we denitrify over there, the nitrogen gas will attach to the slug and rise to the top and we will no longer have clear water come out over our secondary clarifiers. Step three, solidified bacteria is removed from the water and transported to the landfill. Three days a week we process sludge by adding a little bit of chemical called uh, emulsion polymer that coagulates the sludge to get it to stick together. That goes to our secured landfill and buried. Step four, Water is run under an ultraviolet light which kills any remaining harmful bacteria. The water is then transported back to the Mousam River. And the process starts all over again.